What's up, YouTube? We're back. It's your boy, Mad Stecker, and we're here for our second mixed roll hunt of the year. Three nickels, one quarters, and about 58 or so rolls of pennies. We'll pull you back if we find something. Stay tuned. Hey, right, y'all. We are on our third roll of nickels. We've already gone through the quarters as well. Didn't find anything until this third roll. It looks like we've got a find right here. And that is a 1942S over Monticello War Nickel. Can't be mad at that. Sweet. We've got silver. Still going to do the pennies next. We'll be back. All right, YouTube. We are on our eighth roll of pennies and we've got a 1975 Cinco Centavos from Mexico pretty sure that's probably copper I'll have to look it up but it's gonna go up here with our find we've got almost a hundred copper pennies so far we'll keep going All right, here we are, roll number 22 out of 56. And we've got our first weedy of the hunt. This is a 1938 no mint mark. Sweet. We're gonna put that up there with our war nickel and our five centavos. And we will get back to it. We're up to uh, 210 copper pennies so far out of 22 rolls. So it's about 10 per roll average. We'll check back in soon. All right, so here I am in the 29th roll of pennies, and I found another weedy. It's a 1946 no mint mark, second one. Boom. We got. 26 rolls left to go. All right, y'all, welcome back. We are on roll 39 out of 56, and we have found a 1943. Looks like a D that is a steel scent, if I'm not mistaken. Very rusted up, not in great shape at all, but it's a find. It's our third weedy of the box, and we are up to, looks like 370 copper pennies, or copper cents, I'm sorry. And we'll be back when we get some more. All right, y'all, welcome back. We are on roll number 41, and we picked up a 1968 Canadian Penny, one cent. We'll go up there. Is another foreign find, and we'll get back to it. We've got about fifteen rolls to go after this one. We'll be back. All right, here we are, second to last roll. Got one roll left. We've got over five hundred copper cents. We picked up one more. Wheat penny that is a 1956D. That'll be wheat penny number four of the hunt. All right, we'll finish this up and be back for a wrap up. All right, y'all, we are back with the final wrap up from a uh, mixed hunt. We started with one roll of quarters, three rolls of nickels, and 56 rolls of pin cents. I'm sorry, I'm trying to train myself not to say pennies. All right, so we got one 1942S war nickel, 1968 Canadian cent, as well as a 1975 Mexican five centavos. We got a 1938 no mint mark. I'd say that's probably, aside from that war nickel, that's probably the best find. Uh, we got a 1946 
No mint mark. This is a 1943 D steel scent. Not in great shape. And then last but not least, we got a 1956 D wheat scent there. And then, of course, we got 531 copper cents out of those 56 rolls. So less than 10 per roll, but uh, still not a bad average. So these will be going in the bucket that we're trying to fill this year. And, of course, these will go where they go, in their tubes. And this, of course, is going in the stack. And you know, once it goes in the stack, and never goes back. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. As always, going to do a lot of cool hunts this year. Having a lot of fun recording them this way. And uh, hope you guys are enjoying it as well. So thanks for hanging out. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And do not worry about fitting in, in this community. Because we are all mad here.